Flowboarding. I love this sport. It made me recover from my clinical depression. It pushed me hard to become one of the best in the Philippines. But my paradise didn't last long. Blowhouse Manila closed and I was left with no way to ride on. Aqua Planet. What is cooking, guys? It's your boy Porky Pig back at it again with vlog numero ucho, and I am here what? in Clark Pampanga to witness the great Aqua Planet. <laughs> this line is horrible. Very bad, man. So many people. So many people today. Holiday ba ngayon? Is it a holiday? Yeah, it's a day of valor. It's, it's a, a day, day of valor. valor. <laughs> so those are the ticket prices. Kind of don't feel comfortable following all these rules. See, it says no videotaping. I'm videotaping. Another cool thing about this place is it's paperless. So... This wristband has um, an RFID inside which you actually prepay everything that you want to buy inside. So that's cool, I guess. And we are in. One convenient thing about this place is they have their own locker rentals. I don't know what this ride is called, but it's gonna be our first ride of the day. I call it the Longanisa Funnel. And it looks fun uh, and scary. That's a raft elevator, that's cool. It goes all the way up. Would you look at that? Funnel time! That's where you exit. Alright, I'm sorry guys, I don't have any clips of me riding any of the rides. It was not allowed by the administration for me to vlog inside. I think they want you guys to visit and I think you guys should. So yeah, I'm telling you guys now, there are no videos of me riding the rides. So let me describe them for you. There will be no spoilers. The Longanisa Funnel. There should be four people in the raft. The raft goes around the slide, then you drop into the most amazing funnel ever. Then you go up and down the funnel walls. This raft is a fan favorite among my friends, and they say that this has the most enjoyable drop in all of the park. So we're gonna race on these slides. I'm gonna be the red color because I'm cool. Scuderia Ferrari. Scuderia Ferrari. The racing slide. This ride allows for six people to race down a slide in high speed. But before that, the riders will go through some heat exits on the way down. I chose red because of my love of Scuderia Ferrari. And I made it down this slide the farthest because I'm the heaviest among my friends and cause physics. The four slide. There are four differently colored slides with different intensities. I only rode the red and the violet ones as they were the most intense. You have to be a pair to ride the slide and it was fun to back your raft to make you go faster. This is the ride I enjoyed the most because it was the one with the most variety. The Lazy River. Get a lifesaver and ride it around the Lazy River. This is the most chill ride in the park. And I enjoyed it a lot because me and my friends messed around on it. Can you do it? Can you do it? Can you finally do the impossible? I call this ride the quarter pipe and the toilet. You have to ride a raft of four 
it's gonna shoot you down a tube, then up a quarry pipe. You have to hold on to your raft because this is one of the most intense rides in the park. I let go of the raft on the top because I'm cool. We didn't get to ride the toilet because the line was long. Aquapland has a really nice wave pool and it really emulates a nice beach and it's fun to chill here. Boogie Bay. It's a wave pool you can boogie board on. I had so much fun teaching my friends how to ride a boogie board. It's right beside the other wave pool. The Escape Pod. This is the most extreme ride in all of Aqua Planet. You start by getting into an escape pod at the top. The operator counts you down. 3, 2, then a trap door opens up, then you go ah, You get shot down the slide at a very fast speed So fast that the operator can even finish the countdown I enjoyed this ride the most as it made me face my fears and conquer me My friends didn't like this ride, here they are talking about the ride I didn't like the escape pod thing I don't know, I don't like falling yeah. That's Falling in love yeah. yeah, I think the escape pod is also the scariest one for me with the preemption, or at least you know, being prepared for it, I think the escape pod is really the scariest because you don't know what to expect. You don't really, you've never really tried anything like that, which is why it's scary. I found the rider. It's so tiny, it's just one lane. How cute! It was a heartfelt moment when I got on the rider again. Brought back so many good experiences and good memories to mind. I miss the Flow family, the people I used to ride with. I miss abusing my cartel board from practicing on hours on end and as you can see I don't have the skill anymore I want to get that back too I miss flow so coming from a flow border I've heard so many bad reviews that you guys didn't allow them to do uh, stand-up stand-up is part of the sport not just bodyboard and yeah allow us to bring our own boards man comments down below which uh, venue or event you want me to go to and vlog 